there are three terms we often come across in perfumery. Okay, I'll just do this one and then we'll go to lunch. Silage. Silage. <laughs> you have to say it with a French accent, yeah. <laughs> Otherwise it sounds like silage. <laughs> Which is not good, yeah. Okay. So these these are three things we look for in a perfume. Yeah? Now the word diffusion doesn't is not exactly the chemistry de definition. Diffusion is like isoamyl acetate. Isoamyl acetate, you dip it, and then it disappears really quickly. But it diffuses in the room, yeah? So you can smell it over there, but within a few seconds it's gone. That's not interesting for perfume. When perfumers talk about diffusion, uh, it's similar to candle makers talk about throw, yeah? It gives the it sends the smell a long way out, but you don't want it to disappear quickly, yeah? So one of the reasons that materials like ISO-E Super and Hedione have become very popular in perfumes is they have this incredible diffusion, yeah? They diffuse, but they don't disappear. They hang more like a, a shield around the person wearing the perfume which is similar to radiance. So you can feel, you can smell where the source of the smell comes from. So with diffusion, you don't necessarily wear, know where the smell comes from. With radiance, you get direction as well. So you can smell where the smell comes from. I thought that something that I liked in the movie Perfume, has anybody seen it, Perfume? the movie, was when somebody throws something at uh, Jean-Baptiste. Yeah, an orange, and he ducks out of the way because he, he can smell it coming. I think it's actually possible. And that's probably why we have two nostrils. Yeah. And follow the smells, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I think we're just turned off to it. But talking of Jean Baptiste, which is Ryan's other nickname. <laughs> but what fascinated me about Ryan when I, when I first first met him was when he talked about smells, he would talk about like a a rose, and he says no, but it doesn't smell like the rose. It smells like that green bit at the bottom. Yeah which means there's a directional factor, yeah? And I suspect that when you go into a party, yeah, <coughs> you are actually aware of where the smell of that great man or that wonderful woman comes from, yeah? Because I think smell is, is directional. And the more you get turned on to it, the more directional you realize it is. People turn towards towards smells. But it's done at a subconscious level. Yeah. The other one is uh, silage. Silage is when you're walking through the mall and you get to here, you just walk past a beautiful woman and then, wow, what was that smell? Yeah? So it's a little bit like silage because what it, what it is, is, is somehow the smell of that person jumps across to you, travels with you, and then you can still smell it with you. Yeah? Now, probably not as nice, you get this with uh, anybody that's dealt with dead bodies. Having been a policeman, I've dealt with dead bodies. The smell stays with you. Even though you've been just been in the same room, you can smell it afterwards. Yeah, it clings to your it clings to your clothes. Yeah. So the animal notes are quite good for that. Yeah. 
But silage, this is a theory, a theory and uh, I, I think it's probably quite good. It wasn't my idea, it was a, a friend of mine that suggested it. That silage probably is something like sublimation. So anybody that's kept a vanilla pod at home, if you, if you get it in a, like a glass tube, what happens is the, the vanilla, the vanillin from the vanilla pod collects around the glass. The crystals grow around the glass because the, van, the vanillin changes from a solid to gas and then back to a solid. So sublimation could well be something like the vanillin, which, is, which has this good silage, is a vapor finds your, your clothes, and then sticks to your clothes. Yeah, it turns back to a solid. Yeah, so it travels with you. And so a lot of the materials that have good silage are powders. And you smell, you smell the barbecue on you afterwards, yes, yeah. But you've also got good diffusion from smoky smells as well. Yeah. 